Hello YouTube, this is Mr. Chucky Mad. I've now got a Tamiya King Holler based on American Peterville truck. And it's a nice bit of information on the side. Most of it's in Japan. Here's the gear ratios. information on the back of the box right. there's the picture of the free transmission gearbox and see what we've got inside Right, we have chassis rails, and if no one's ever done this before, probably most of you have, they actually marked with left and right on them, so you know which side they go. Here's the cab, classic American cab. We have um, the windscreen and the side windows, chrome parts. We have the fuel tanks. Um, they're the roof lights, air horns. They look like the back of the, the um, wing mirrors. Some steps to go on that and the same that side more chrome and we have the ends ends of the bull tanks and side steps we have um, more chrome nearly air in, air intakes the top roof spot the spoiler there the cab front light mountains um, bottom parts of the, the stacks and there's the grill on the other side we have the front bumper rear bumper and rear wheel arch mounts and two bits there to hold the mud flaps on and there's your, your switch to put your switch on and the uncoupling Two boxes. Box one out of the way. We have all your set your tyres. In here we have parts bag B, which is all screws and nuts. Um, metal parts for your discs and cogs. Here's your bearings. Uh, metal parts we've got back of the diff mounts, suspension mounts, I believe. There's another metal part. bag E which is small screws and some washers got different screws in there um, small bits there I can't remember what they're for Metal parts there, 
different bits. Different tools and stuff. Here's your grease. Tie downs. Parts bag C. Which is small screws and nuts. You have these bits here are your top of your mounts for your, um, your stacks, your U-bolts and other bars. Parts bag F, which is all screws. Parts bag A, more screws and nuts. Got metal parts here, we've got and that there, you can just see, is the fifth wheel plate cover and there for the rear suspension I don't know what the small ones are for, I can't remember and there for your gearbox you have um, the rear mud flaps your wire mesh and your springs for your dampers Parts bag D, then more screws. We have um, the four big bars are to hold the gearbox together. And in there you've got um, the handles and possibly the wind mirror mounts. Um, got metal parts there. Plus we hold the cab down, get your gearbox, the changing, and that's your fifth wheel to hold your fifth wheel down. Important lock thread. Back to the other one. The other one you've got parts on the top. You've got up the top there, you've got two stuck exhaust covers you got gearbox shift shafts there you've got different cogs there you've got the diff shafts there you've got three gear bits your, your ring gears here's your long prop shaft and your short prop shaft We've got leaf springs there and your front axle. There's the motor. Here's your damper covers. I don't know why Tamiya do their trucks in pink. I haven't got a clue. In this bum, we've got the gearbox cover covers and the rear diff covers. We have um, suspension mounts. Um, these bits are to hold the fuel tanks on and other plastic bits which I haven't got a clue. Um, we've got the fifth wheel plate. Um, these bits to hold the servos on. And the back of your light covers, I think. We have all your light lenses in different colours and cross members. There's your front set of wheels. And there's your backs, your doolies. Um, we've got the gear change cogs. We've got to change the gear. Got more cogs there. We have um, that plate is for the 
the sleeper mount, and that's for the cab mount. We have there we have the fifth wheel and the steering mounts. Um, we've got dashboard seats and the steering wheel there. Um, that bit there, you have to go onto the cab of the roof to go on there, and that's to go at the back. We have a nice long aerial, which I probably won't be using. We have a set of decals. Nice set of decals. Here's the most important bit, the instructions. Tell you do nice and easy instructions. Step by step. Um, I'm going to build mine standard. Um, the only thing that I'm going to put in mine, I'm going to put a basic light kit in the truck and I'm going to put on, um, I've got on the, there, I've got that, the, the Tamiya roof spoiler, but they're in another box and I'll get them out at a later date. So thank you for watching this unboxing of the King Hauler and see you soon, bye bye for now.